McLaren's brake drum hole has become the centre of a Formula One scandal, with accusations of rule bending and espionage flying around the paddock. Team principal Andrea Stella seemed caught off guard by the sudden spotlight on what he claims is a simple matter. Red Bull, ever the vigilant watchdog, blew the whistle on McLaren's clever, or should we say, sneaky, design feature. The hole in question, supposedly for sensor access, raised eyebrows and suspicions of an illegal cooling mechanism. The FIA, jolted into action by Red Bull's alarm, swooped in to demand a cover-up, literally. McLaren, along with another unnamed team, had apparently been flaunting these holes at recent races, only to hastily slap on tape when the heat turned up. Stella, clearly on the defensive, tried to downplay the controversy. Actually, this matter is very simple, he insisted to Sky F1, his words dripping with forced nonchalance. We got the clarification from the FIA that this hole is not allowed and we just taped it. But is it really that simple? Or is this just the tip of the iceberg in a sea of technical trickery? Stella's bewilderment at the escalation seems almost too innocent. It's a very, very simple matter which, for some reason, seems to have escalated to become a topic in the paddock, he claimed, perhaps a little too emphatically. But nothing of that kind. Is this a case of McLaren pushing the boundaries of innovation or a blatant attempt to skirt the rules? And what other secrets might be lurking beneath the sleek exteriors of F1's fastest machines? In Formula One, even the smallest hole can blow up into a storm of controversy.